am I in man? Always interrupting me when I'm doing my work. Go, go away, Iron Man! I'm doing my work! Hang on a minute. I thought Iron Man was away on some sort of secret Avenger business this week. Hmm. Excuse me, guys. I better check the door. Guys, guys, okay, there's someone out there, oh man, this is my new friend. I've been really excited to introduce you to my new friend. Uh, I, I, I'm so excited for you, to, for you guys to meet this guy. Okay, okay, everything looks okay, it's nice and neat, nice and tidy. Oh my Star Lord, oh my Star Lord. Okay, okay, please everybody, I want you to meet, I want you to meet my new friend! Star Lord! Yes! Star Lord! Hello! Woo. Oh, and he has mail! You have mail! Thank you, Star Lord! Thank oh, 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 oh! Are you okay? <laughs> Star Lord! Oh, man! Look, this guy! Whoa! Star Lord! He's brought me mail! You're already better than Iron Man! Ah, oh, Star Lord! Oh, my Star Lord! Okay, can I open this? I can I open it on the channel? Okay, you got some mail here from Star Lord today. What do we got? Oh, oh, it's an Amazon package! You've come all the way from Amazon! What have we got? What have we got? Oh! Oh! Guardians of the Galaxy Volume 2 and 3D! It's you! It's Star Lord! On the cover! What do you reckon we do an unboxing of this? Yes! Okay! Let's do it! And we'll watch it! Oh, Star Lord! I love this guy! Okay! Let's do an unboxing Guardians of the Galaxy Volume 2 in 3D! Come on! Oh! I told you, this guy's awesome! Oh! I'm gonna grab the disc! Oh! So excited! Star Lord! Star-Lord! Okay, one final Blu-ray unboxing for Guardians of the Galaxy Volume 2 on Blu-ray. Of course, today we are taking a look at the 3D edition of the film as released in the UK. Of course, this film, as most Disney films, was not released mass-marketed in 3D over in the United States. Uh, this was released as a Best Buy exclusive, I believe, in that steelbook. Came with the 4K disc and like a whole bundle package thing. And from what I understand, there was very, very limited stock of that. And a lot of people struggled to even get their hands on that set. Uh, you know, Disney's been trying to phase out 3D in the US for quite a while now. And um, it came back for a bit. And then now it's sort of going by the wayside. And they're only offering it as retailer exclusives, which is it's very frustrating for those in the US. But luckily, we do have importation options. The 3D of course was released in Australia, didn't have this lovely little slip cover on it so I had to uh, had to give it the old import myself. So we're going to be taking a look at the UK edition of the 3D which is a very nicely presented edition might I add. The first thing that really excited me about this cover art actually was the fact that it uses different cover art to the 4K edition here so that was very exciting to me. We get the uh, standard movie poster on the 3D artwork and then the I think it was like an international Japanese poster I think is what they've used here on the 4K artwork. So it's nice you get you get something different between each one it's not the same copy paste job there which sometimes annoys me if you end up having to buy two at least you got different cover art there. So let's get that out of the way we've already reviewed that and let's take a good look at this. This is a really nice slipcover actually. Disney are doing are producing some really nice slipcovers in the UK recently. Uh, usually they didn't have much embossing. They didn't. They weren't really shiny or anything like that. It's pretty plain, matte, flat. But they're actually putting a bit of decent effort into it, which means importing it doesn't sting as much when you don't feel like you're getting an inferior slipcover or anything like that. So this is nice. We've got this nice little shimmer in the background. It's sort of like a metallic sort of uh, reflective sort of thing, which is nice. It's always good to see. And then uh, Guardians of the Galaxy Volume 2 is all embossed through here. So is the Marvel Studios logo. A little Groot there, baby Groot. You've got a little embossing on him there. The rest of it's pretty flat, but that's I think that's a pretty nice level of embossing on that. I'll give you a nice close-up of that there as you can see as I sort of turn around it's got this really the nice metallic shimmer that I was talking about there and of course you can see the uh, the embossing when I put the uh, the light over it there as well so it's a really cool cover I really like that and, and again the colors just bursting off there which is really fitting for the movie because the colors in this are just absolutely beautiful all right so let's take a look at the back cover of the uh, 3d disc 
Again, we're going to compare it to the 4K cover there on the back. It's using some of the same artwork, but it's a little bit different. The layout here is a little bit different. But of course, then we are comparing a UK set to a US set, so there's always some sort of difference there. But uh, as you can see, it's sort of it's sort of designed the same. But anyway, there's your uh, your back cover right there. There's not a whole lot of uh, stuff going on there. It's got a little bit of a shimmer in the background. You know, not not as much as the front cover. Now, special features here. We've got exactly the same as the other releases. If you haven't watched any of my other reviews, of course, we get a making of Guardians of the Galaxy Volume Two, the Guardians Inferno music video, a gag reel, deleted scenes, audio commentary with James Gunn, and uh, a little video intro from James Gunn at the beginning of the movie there. So a uh, fairly decent amount of stuff. So let's take the slip off. Ooh, we've actually got a bit of uh, shrink wrapping on here. Usually I'm impatient and take these out of the shrink before uh, I do a review. So let's... Uh... As always, our front cover here is exactly the same as our slip cover there. The only difference is we don't get that border. Your back's exactly the same. We're going to open up and show you what we get inside this. Of course, just as like Australia has, the UK have done away with the DVD copy of the film as well as the digital copy. So you get the discs and that's it. You have the standard Blu-ray 2D and of course the Blu-ray 3D over here as well. Standard Disney blue disc, white writing, boring. Luckily enough, the 4K, again if you haven't seen my review of that, the 4K disc got a, lot, a nice little bit of disc art on there. Pretty boring, nothing incredibly special there, but really didn't expect much more from this set. But at least we get this in 3D. Once again it is an option for you guys out there. You can import this. If you want this slip cover, the UK slips usually sell out really, really quickly. So try and get your hands on this one as quickly as you can. We're going to go back to the couch now. I'm going to give a quick review on the picture quality and the uh, talk a little bit about the 3D presentation of this movie. Okay, once again that is Guardians of the Galaxy Volume 2 on 3D disc from the UK. As you can see I've got Star-Lord right up the back there getting impatient because, well we've just watched the movie and he wants to watch it again so this Star Lord he is one crazy guy uh, look before we do that Star Lord I do have to say a couple of things about the 3d disc itself this is an incredible 3d transfer right here this is pretty much a demo worthy disc 3d technology is just getting better and better and some of the 3d discs that we've had lately are some of the best that have ever been released it's such a shame that the studios think that there isn't a market for these anymore because there really certainly is a market watching Guardians of the Galaxy even the first this movie in 3D adds an extra level to your immersive experience. These movies are both very immersive films. The cinematography, the colours, just absolutely everything really draws you in and adding that 3D level of depth is just a completely different experience for this movie. And it's such a shame that in the US they're getting rid of this. You know, they're making it really hard for people to get their hands on the 3D disc. The good thing is the UK 3D discs are region free just as all Disney DVD discs are region free. So if you're in the US you can certainly import this. Best Buy as I said earlier made this available as an exclusive uh, in the steelbook with the 4k but that's long sold out now from all accounts so you can pick this up from the UK. I do want to say there are people out there who are probably wondering about shifting aspect ratio. Yes this disc does include the shifting aspect ratio of course a decent percentage of the movie was uh, presented in the IMAX format so the ratio does shift throughout the movie you get a bigger image and then a smaller image and there's so much of the movie in the shifting aspect ratio that you don't really know it too much but yes there is a shift he's getting really really comfortable back there it also includes what is like a uh, an aspect Uh, hmm. It also has what's called like an aspect break. So characters jumping out of the black bars of the screen, a little bits of like thing, like explosions popping out of the screen and stuff like that. As I said, it's a really immersive, immersive 3D experience and it's a completely different way to experience the movie. I think this would even trump the 4K experience of this film. Colors on that are gorgeous, but this is just one immersive experience and it really is, as I said, demo worthy for this. He's getting really restless up the back. He's got him Himself a little blanket there. I have to put this movie on. Okay, you ready? You excited? Okay, he's getting excited. All right, let's wrap this video up once again. Guardians of the Galaxy Volume Two available on 3D right now. If you have to import it from the from the UK, just go ahead and do that and get it while you can still get the slip covers. I said UK slip covers don't stick around very long. Um, thank you to everybody out there for joining me. If this is the first video of mine you have watched and you enjoy what you've seen, you want to give me some support, please after the jump hit subscribe. To my regular viewers out there, thank you once again for joining me. To absolutely everybody out there, I hope I'll see you again soon. Until next time, though, guys, take care and I hope you have a marvelous day. See ya. Yeah, all right, let's put this movie on again.